Good morning guys from your favorite tomato. <laughs> I can't get over the sunburn. I can't look at myself seriously. Oh, oh, I thought my lights went off. They're still on. Hello everybody. It is yet again another summer daily vlog. Are you guys hyped? Because I'm hyped and I just, I love summer. It's about 1130 and I woke up around 9 and I got some video stuff done and I made myself some eggs because I love eggs. And then I jumped right back into bed because I can, because it's summer and I just, I love not having many responsibilities. Um, I do, but I just don't have school. And guys, I got my final grades this morning and your girl is so chillin', I'm so happy. There's nothing better than like being on summer break and like seeing that you got a notification from like your grading saying like you got your grades back and then you're like scared and you're like, should I ruin my summer or should I look? And then you look and then your summer's great and you're like, no, I haven't had coffee yet today. As soon as I was ready to start my day, the sky decided to get gray, which is not cool. But it's okay because this whole weekend was so sunny, so beautiful, Mother's Day was perfect. We went on the boat, my mom had an amazing day. We treated her like a queen, it was such a good day. Of course, on Monday, though, it gets all stupid and thunderstormy. I didn't bring my Keurig or an espresso home from college because I didn't want to drink as much coffee each day. I was like, if I'm gonna drink coffee here, it's if like my mom makes it in the morning and there's like a pot of coffee, or if I treat myself and go to Starbucks. I don't know, I use going to get coffee as a way to kind of get started for the day. So I'm just feeling super lazy and I need to get out of this laziness because there's just no point. I'm home alone right now, my brother's at school and my mom is at yoga, she's teaching yoga and my dad's at work, so I'm bored. All my friends from high school get home today, AKA we can't really hang today because they're all like getting home today, but the rest of this week is about to be so fun. I think we have plans to like go to the beach and go to Oxford Exchange and just, I love my friends from high school and I'm so excited to reunite with them. So today is my last day to kind of get my life together before, you know, all my friends start to come and my friends from college are visiting next week. So we've got lots going on um, and it's kind of nice to have downtime, which I'm trying to like appreciate. So today I'm gonna go get coffee, like I said before, just kind of go for a little drive, get some coffee, get out of the house. And then we are finally going to unpack if you can't see, I have it unpacked. My room is a mess. My closet here has random clothes in it that I probably need to go through and like take to Goodwill and stuff like that. Or I might save some for my friends to go through. So yeah, I'm kind of in the mood to just purge and clean out, clean out my bathroom, just really, really clean out. Cause I'm gonna be living here the next two months. I might as well, you know, make it a good environment. Wow, my face is so red. But yeah, a lot of you guys ask me why I don't sell on Poshmark or Depop. To be honest, I just, I get a lot of clothing for free, so I feel really weird selling clothing that I got for free, and it's kind of hard to organize just sending out free clothing, if that makes sense. So I just choose to give it away or give it to my friends. Um, it's nothing against you guys. I do want to sell on Poshmark, and I think that's a really cool idea, um, but I'm just such a believer in you know, giving back to thrift stores and just sharing with my friends. So that's just personally how I like to do it. Um, maybe one day I'll feel more comfortable selling my clothes. I just feel uncomfortable doing it, honestly. And it, it is a lot of work and I would have to really, you know, cut out time every day to do it. So that's just that. My room is an absolute mess and it was so clean when I first got here. I haven't even opened some packages. I need to do that. Um, but yeah, my goal is to obviously unpack. I still have stuff in my car even, but I need to like clean out everything before I unpack everything because there's nowhere to put all this stuff. I want to clear out my desk so it's like actually somewhere I can work at. Hey, what's up? I love this shirt so much. It's like my nightgown. And then over here, I have like all my bathing suits I brought home. I have like a suitcase full of like my hats and accessories and sunglasses. And then in my closet, I have all these random clothing that I left here that... <clears throat> some I'm gonna keep obviously, but some I can totally give away. So I need to go through all that before I unpack clothing. Um, I also kind of want to go through my accessories. And then I've got this out here for like my overflow clothing. Yeah, I know I'm psycho. I just have a really small closet, okay? And then my bathroom is just simply a mess. I haven't unpacked any of my products. I might have to buy a little organizer or something. Or what I'm gonna do is these drawers have been full of random stuff for years. So I think it's time I clean those out in my bathroom. It's just gonna be a day. And then I'm scheduled for a spin class tonight at camp, so that'll be good. I am trying to cycle every other day, or work out every other day, but hopefully cycling, because I love cycling. So yeah, that'll be tonight. Maybe I'll grab dinner on my own after that. I don't really know. I don't know, that's just the overview for today. Sorry, that was a lot of talking. It was just necessary. Oh, I also have this suitcase to unpack, yeah. 
yeah here is a little outfit of the day i'm wearing this top from lululemon it's just like a crop tank sports bra situation biker shorts are also from lululemon i love them they're just this is just like a great comfy outfit to do stuff in sunglasses are celine bag shoes i wow i'm actually really being extra right now i just realized but yeah let's go get some coffee and just start our day right <laughs> some sick soundcloud remixes i'm making a playlist on my soundcloud right now called summer 19 with just like happy vibe remix stuff like that because i'm really into stuff like that um stuff like that stuff like that how many times i think i'm gonna try the nitro cold brew if they have it but some starbucks just don't have it and just with my luck they won't have it but maggie's been talking about it a lot and i tried brooks and it was really good i would just have to get a little soy milk in it for you hi do you guys have nitro here no, we're getting it on the 22nd. We'll have it soon. Okay, no worries. Um, Then can I get a venti iced coffee with soy milk, please? No sweetener in that? No sweetener. You got it. Anything else for that? That's it. It's going to be 370. We'll see you at the window. Thank you. Thank you. What did I say? Just with my luck, they won't have the nitro. Starbucks wants us to be happy. <laughs> We're doing great. Woo! Party time. That was a very odd encounter. <laughs> I really need to get a car wash. My car is in need of a car wash, and I find car washes very relaxing. I like going in the ones where you like are still in the car. It's just very therapeutic. I'm gonna go to my favorite car wash that I haven't been to in forever. It, like. It like does all these like colorful soaps and stuff. I just I know that sounds really weird, but like I've missed it um, And I know it's gonna rain day. So this is probably kind of dumb But my car is gonna be under our carport. So I shouldn't it shouldn't be an issue. Oh my gosh. Yes Let's go. I'm starting to get concerned. It has been on this pre Soak tire clean. I don't even know what that's for about four minutes now and I'm pretty sure the water is missing my car Like I don't know like I know I pulled up to the right I'm very disappointed right now. I'm nervous. I've never had to do this before but I think I'm just gonna literally have to drive out because It's just not oh I'm nervous all right, here we go. We literally have to. Here I go. Yep, there's there's the water and the soap. Okay, now I can't even see. There's two washes you can go in, so I guess I'm just gonna go in the other one and hope this one actually works. This is what we were stuck on last time, the tire cleaner. Pray for me, guys. Yay, here it comes. My literal favorite part. Ah, look how beautiful she is. Like, literally, what? All right, we did it. I'm literally in my driveway right now on Instagram Live just because everyone's being so sweet. Say hey. Aw, I love when you guys say hi to the vlog. Shout yourselves out, homies. I got home just in time, it's raining now. But look how clean she is. I just don't want to drive again until it stops raining because my car looks so good. That was the longest Starbucks run ever, am I right? <laughs> Welcome to Florida in the summer. We usually get one of these a day and then it just gets sunny again. But today it looks like it might be raining all day. I don't know. This is ugly. All right. It is time to tackle everything. I, I truly don't know where to start. I need to get some trash bags. All right. I think I'm going to start with my desk area so that I can clean up my desk, throw random papers away, recycle things that I don't need, and then put all my electronics, organize my desk, and then I'll do my closet, because I am truly dreading doing that. Guys, I just found my UGA acceptance letter. So I'm cleaning out my desk and I found an old planner from 2017. This is when I was a senior and like this was just how crazy I was in high school. Like not crazy, like wild, but like I was a busy, busy gal. I like would write down, I would write down everything. I had rehearsal, I did pep rallies. 
on my homework. This is so interesting. All right, here is a little update. This is the best I could do for now. I organized this so it's like organized chaos now. It's just, that's just an organized. That's just how it's gonna be. Um, I haven't decided if I wanna take all that stuff down yet. It's like happy memorabilia stuff, but it kind of makes everything look messy, but it also makes me happy. Like this quote I wrote for myself, like a tag for my backpack, meaning you guys. A newspaper article is in. I don't really know. I, I have some jewelry here that's not gonna stay here. I just need to organize my jewelry organizer. This has literally just become not useful at all because I don't put anything in it because I have all this old jewelry in here. Guys, you're gonna die. Like, I have my old, like, J. Crew necklaces. Remember when these were popular and you'd wear them with, like, collared shirts? So I need to go through this and, like, give away stuff. Like, oh my gosh, do you guys remember the J. Crew rose necklace? <laughs> And then all these are completely full with like just really random jewelry. Like all my old monogram necklaces. I'm emo. Oh my gosh, I used to wear those every day. So I think this is what I'm going to do next just because I can't have all this jewelry here. Like I need to actually use this. So let's get after it, boys. Guys, I am like going back to the past. Like... If you guys dance or used to dance, do you guys remember these? I used to be obsessed with these. These were, um, we called them foot undies. And they were for, like, um, lyrical and contemporary classes. Oh, my gosh. I had so many. I had this kind. This is just so... I really just don't need these anymore, though. How sad. I miss dance. It's pretty clean for the most- Oh, I forgot about this! Oh my gosh. I forgot because I always have things on top so I can never lift it. Oh my gosh. I thought I was done. I might just leave this as is for now. Guys, I used to be obsessed with like wearing- Do you guys remember when these were a thing like the double rings? Oh my gosh, this is so- This was from my Tumblr days when I tried to be cool in Tumblr. All these double rings. Do you guys remember this from Tumblr? Like, holy crap. I brought all my jewelry from school here, all organized in different little baggies. So I'm gonna hang those up. I have already hung some up here and put some in like these little organizational things because I thought that would be helpful. All right, woo, that was easy. This is empty now. I've got a ton of um, travel makeup makeup jewelry bags there now so I have to put those away but we've got kind of my longer more statement ish necklaces on this side and then some um, smaller necklaces there and then I love this little drawer on the top of my dresser I don't know where I got this by the way this is like years old um, but it like has this good material so like your jewelry kind of sticks to it I don't know how to explain it I'm able to kind of organize all my little small necklaces like that I put all of my bigger earrings here. Forgot about this. Okay, so this is where I can put my bracelets. This is perfect. So I just opened some mail finally. I got a ton of really cute stuff from Free People Movement. I'll do a haul for you guys in a second. Um, but I also got sent this. It's spun gel. It's a body wash infused buffer. So I'm going to put this in my shower and I feel like that's awesome. Like you just wet it and like it has all these benefits. Works for 14 plus showers. I'm about to be smelling good. I also just got some fun goodies from Tone It Up. I've been watching Tone It Up on YouTube for years, literally. So it's kind of crazy whenever they send me stuff. I seriously want to try these out right now. They're snickerdoodle flavored protein bites. Yes. Free People is awesome and they sent me a ton of stuff from their new movement line that I'm obsessed with. There's these pants that I wear from there that you guys always ask me where they're from. And they're from Free People Movement. And I got a, another pair of those pants in a different color. So I'll show you guys that today. And I'll have them linked down below so you guys can check them out. But they're these pants. I believe they're called the Goldie Pants. And I have them in tan. And I wore them. I think I wore them in my Coachella vlog. Or something. And you guys are freaking out. So I got them in black this time. They are so dang comfortable. They're like big balloon pants. And they like tie on the side. They're like harem pants kind of. And then I just got this shirt. Because I just thought it was fun. It says Thrills Company. Um, it's just kind of like a big fun graphic tee. I kind of plan to cut it. And make it like a crop top situation. Or I might leave it long and wear it with biker shorts. I'm not really sure yet, but 
we shall see i also got some biker shorts from there because i wear these a lot over the summer um so these are just what they look like they've got slight detail nothing crazy i got a couple crop tops so i got this one that's perfect for like yoga and some lower intensity workouts or if i just want to wear this on its own just as an outfit i feel like that'd be chill and then i also got this super cute white top yeah this one has really cute detailing in the back i thought this would be good for spin and i don't know what came over me but i just had to have this it's so dope it's a jumpsuit but like sweatshirt material with shorts so it's like good for the summer I got it in a size small i'm usually a medium in most things but i got a small because free people tends to run big i've noticed so definitely size down in their stuff i suggest um, but yeah, it's just super comfortable. It's like black and gray. So yeah, that's everything that they sent me I just thought it'd be cool to just kind of share with you guys a little, a little haul in this vlog and Just time to start with the closet and I'm just oh, dreading it so much <laughs> Low-key a madhouse in here right now, but I just unpacked all of my pants that I brought back from Athens So I've got all of my denim there and then my fun summery flowy skirts shorts And then I have to put all my shirts which is going to be oh someone's calling me my brother mm -hmm. So we're having pho for lunch yeah. pho. <laughs> So you make it on your own so you put that in first wait the only thing I don't want is the jalapenos Got cilantro, is that the rice noodles? Mm -hmm. it's really and then good. those are good, I forgot the name. Sprouts. Yum yum. Oh, that looks amazing. <laughs> and you just mix it around. Mm -hmm. Nothing like some pho and watching Ellen. This is what my mom does. I need a little boost. I need a little boost, let's do it. Making major progress. Cleaned out a ton of my old shoes, put my new ones in there, cleaned out all my hats. Now I just have the hats that I actually like to wear. I cleaned out my bathing suit drawer because I had all these old bathing suits from legit, like Justice for Girls that I hadn't cleaned out. So now I have my most current ones in there, my pajamas are in here, um, new shoes here. And I actually have one more suitcase in my car still of clothes that I need to hang up. All right, we've moved to workout wear. I literally have no space in my closet for my workout wear, and I have a lot. So I had these two under my bed bins, which is so clutch. So these are all my shorts, leggings, workout pants. And then this is going to be all of my workout tops. Back in the car, and now I'm headed to spin. I decided to do a later spin class today. I'm glad I did the night one, because I got so much done today. I still have more to do in my room for sure, but that's okay. So yeah, I'm gonna get a good sweat session and then I'm just gonna drive right back home and my mom's making us dinner and we're gonna watch The Bachelorette. Yeah, baby. Once again, a great class. I've never taken this instructor before and he was so good. His music was just good and I just sweat. Like, and I feel so good. And I saw some more of my friends from high school. So I got one of these, the Mother Kombucha to go. It's the blood orange ginger. It's gonna look like I'm drinking beer. No drinking and driving here. It's kombucha, but it just looks kinda suggestive. <laughs> Let's see if this one's good. I've never tried this flavor. Ugh, that's really good. Anything with ginger, I'm into. All right, friends, I am back. I am sweaty. I'm gonna get in the shower and just kind of enjoy my night with my family. We're gonna watch The Bachelorette and eat some dinner. So I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys very soon for our next video. Bye-bye.